This is the girls 15, 16, 400 individual medley finals. In lane number one at the bottom of your screen is Alex Rigger, unattached. Lane two, Taylor Cartagena, Nova, Virginia. Lanes three, four, five, and six, all unattached. Kathleen Mulligan in three, Tara Halstead, your leader from this morning in lane number four, Whitney Georgeson in five, Leah Goldman in six, in lane number seven from Chico Aqua Jets is Kathleen West, in lane number eight, Rachel Wasco from Sun Oaks Aquatics, very tight field halfway through this Hunter Butterfly leg, in the middle of the pool to get their hand on the wall first, lane number four, Tara Halstead, 27-64 at the 50. About a half a body length lead here after the butterfly leg. That's still Tara Halstead out front. 59-25, the only swimmer in this field under one double O here after the Hunter Butterfly. She's followed by lane five, Whitney Georgeson, who is a one double O 48, but right with her in lane number three there, Kathleen Mulligan, and up there in lane number six, that's Leah Goldman. So a very close race there for second. Tara Halstead trying to separate her field here in the backstroke. She's now about a body length lead over Georgeson in lane number five. Tara Halstead in lane four continues to build her lead after 150. This morning, Tara was a 428.75. So we'll see how that stacks up tonight. We've already seen the 17 and 18 year olds shave off multiple seconds from their prelim swim. So we might see the same thing here for the 15, 16 year olds. The current record here in this event is a 415. So we'll see how she stacks up after the backstroke leg. She's a good two to three body lengths a lead. 204.52 there at the halfway mark. She is still followed by lane five, Winnie Georgeson. 209.19. So about four and a half second lead right there for Tara Halstead. But as we know, this heat can definitely change it up in the breaststroke leg. That's Tara Halstead in the middle of the pool. But in lane five on the, is Whitney Jorgensen, who's got a really good breaststroke. Looking very strong there in lane number five, trying to in catch the leader, lane Whitney lane Georgeson. She's probably reduced it now to about a body length lead, or as before, is about two to three. Tara Halstead still out front. Whitney Georgeson securing that second place position and now moving into third in lane number three. Tara that's Halstead Kathleen Mulligan. Up there in the top of your lane with a great brush, top of your screen with a great breaststroke leg in lane number eight. That's Rachel Wasco. She's trying to chase down that third place position from Kathleen Mulligan, but still looking very strong here after the breaststroke. Tara Halston, lane number four. Three twenty three zero five there for Tara. Three twenty six forty eight. So still about a two and a half second difference between the ladies. It was about four and a half going into that breaststroke leg. So Georgeson definitely made up some yardage, but Tara Halstead looks like she might have this one secured. Whitney Jorgensen in five. That's Kathleen Milligan in three. Tara Hall said, definitely on pace to be under her prelim time from this morning. Once again, was a 428. She puts together a good 50 here. She's definitely going to be the low 20s. Looking very strong. Still a lot of white water coming from that kick. She is going to be your champion here in the girls. 15, 16, 400 individual, individual medley. Touching unofficially with a 422, 33. Great six second time drop for Tara Halstead. Touching in second is Whitney Georgeson, 427.57. And taking third, lane number three, Kathleen Mulligan with a 432.80.